Hey, my shortcake minions! What is up today? It is a cold and rainy day here in Texas, so I decided to do a slow cooker chicken and dumplings. So, here we go. Let's see if I can get y'all here. There we go. Now, what you're going to need, it's basically five ingredient chicken dumplings. So, chicken, pure chicken soup, one. Your onions, which we're going to dice. Plus two. Your chicken tenders or chicken breast. So that's one, two, three. Chicken broth. And the last one. Is your Grand's biscuits. So that's five. And you can get all of this for just 10 bucks or less. How great is that? That is awesome, if you ask me. Now, what you're going to do, and I know I haven't done a cooking video in a while. Move y'all over here. And if y'all want to see more, just let me know. I've just been doing little things, you know, vlogs, vlogs, um, with the fur babies, singing, which I haven't done in a while either, and I intend to do that. I really do. It's just been crazy for me. What happens? So, you're going to dice up your onions. Now, it calls for a half of onion. This is I love onions, and my husband loves onions. I'm doing a whole one. Like I said, you can get this easy recipe. Just five ingredients for under... Well, 10 bucks or less. And it's so simple. So, so simple. Okay. Now that we got our onions cut. Hold on. There we go. Show y'all here. them all ah! cut up <laughs> now get y'all straight again there we go <laughs> so what we're going to do is put our you're going to set your crock pot on high. And you're going to go for eight hours. But if you want it within four to five hours, you can set it. I'm sorry. Low is eight hours. And if you want it to four to five hours, you set it on high. So we'll open up our I got chicken tin tenders.
So you'll set your chicken tenders, chicken breast. Now if you're going to do chicken breast, um, you can do three to four how many chicken breasts you want, depending. chicken tenders and to the crock pot and it's always important to wash your hands after you handle the bok bok chicken <laughs> So it's very easy. Now, the chicken broth uh, it calls for 14 ounces. I thought it is 32 ounces, so I'm going to measure out with the 10 ounce cans. And it's very important to season too. Salt, pepper, just a little bit. Just sprinkle the parsley in there. Now I got the chicken broth. I'm using the cans to measure. So this is just a 10 ounce can. I'm going to fill the can up and then half. And if you want to add vegetables, which I'm going to do, um, I'm going to add carrots to it. There we go. Put these in the trash can. going. Your eight hours are up or your four hours are up with the high cooking. You'll add your biscuits. You'll cut those biscuits into eight, eight pieces or quarter them. It's up to you. I want to use the whole can and you'll put them and mix them in. Once you shred up your chicken You'll add your biscuits. I'm all the way right now. Once your time is up, you'll take your chicken out. You'll shred it. Put the chicken back in. Add your cut biscuits. Mix them up. Add another hour to that. And there, you'll have your slow-cooked chicken and dumplings. 
So, good for a cold day, rainy day. It's supposed to be snowing today, but it's raining. Weatherman, get your act together. I love you guys. <laughs> I love you guys. Smooches and hugs. Mwah. Bye.